Mary's Place is here because of the incredible and continued support of our community. Um, number one way, which might not be a surprise, is of course uh, funding. Um, so being able to support with donations is incredible. Um, I, I think I may have mentioned before that we are, the vast majority of our operations and funds come from from private entities, come from individuals, come from corporations, and so any amount that someone is able to give is truly impactful for the work that we're able to do. Um, we have lots of other ways to be involved as well, whether it's volunteering, if someone as an individual or as a group, whether it's you, your family, um, your work group, want to come and work actually in a shelter and provide, provide meal service um, or help throw a birthday party for kids in shelter. We have a lot of different opportunities there, um, opportunities to do things remotely, um, like building kits that we might need in shelter, um, or for families who are recently housed, we have welcome home baskets that have some goodies that are, we're able to give to families when they first move home. Um, cold care kits, so if a family is sick in shelter, we can have little, uh, again, goodie bags to be able to provide to them. Um, we also have a wonderful program, it's called Make a Home, which is kind of exactly how it sounds, which is really just connecting different community groups to families who are moving out of shelter into housing and helping set that house up like a home because when families fall into homelessness, they are most likely losing almost all of their possessions. And as incredible and wonderful as it is to move into a new house, if it's empty, it's really not gonna feel like home. And that is expensive to have to restock and get the bed and get a dresser, kitchen tape, chairs, all of those things. So the Make a Home program is a great way for people to get together, collect these items, um, and actually go and set this home up for this family. And sometimes that might be a little too, too much, making a home can be big so make a room is another option as well um, so other really fun ways to kind of get involved um, and I'll also mention too that we as we are coming up on a holiday season we always like to have our we have a holiday giving program in which we aim to provide gift cards to families um, teens and parents specifically in shelter so that they can do their own shopping for each other um, as well as collecting new toys for kids who are 10 and under so that's a great way to get involved too to help ensure that our families can enjoy the holidays together um, and lastly, and probably more importantly, um, I like to always share the biggest way to support is really um, to spread awareness, right? To, to be able to educate yourself, to educate everyone about the causes and complexities of family homelessness and the solutions that we do believe can work um, and advocate working with people that can make those decisions at the systemic level um, to ensure that families do have access to opportunity, that families do all have access to safety and state stability and health.